Hello and welcome back to another episode of Teaching Partner. Reading research papers is crucial for teachers as it helps them stay up to date with the latest trends and best practices in their field. It also helps them to understand the different teaching methodologies and techniques that have been proven effective through research. With the help of research papers, teachers can better design their curriculum, lesson plans and assessment methods. Artificial intelligence can make this process easier and more productive by automating various tasks such as literature searching, data analysis and report generation. AI can quickly go through a large volume of research papers and identify the most relevant and important ones. In this video, I am going to share one magical app that will make your teaching research easier. This tool is called Science Space Copilot. Science Space Copilot is an AI-powered research assistant that explains academic literature including text, mathematics involved in it, and tables in research papers and articles. It is available as a free Chrome extension that saves time and effort while reading technical papers, reports, or articles or any web page on your Chrome browser. In addition to providing explanation of literature, Copilot also offers a range of other features such as the ability to search for related articles and to ask questions about the text you are reading. So let's explore the tool which is known as Science Space Copilot. I'm sharing from the very scratch so you will not face any difficulty. So I'm writing Science Space Copilot and you can see here the option you can just click on this. Once you click you can see here there is an option to add to Chrome. So you can just select add to Chrome. So once you click on this extension you can see here the Science Space Copilot extension is available on the right side of the window. So I'm going to just go to my library. Uh, right now I don't have any file in library so I need to add upload files. So what I did I have already downloaded two educational research papers. One is about neuroscience and one is about factor of absenteeism uh, among high school students. So I'm going to just upload one by one and let's explore the tools and the magic of science space copilot. So I'm going to click. So you can see on the screen I have two papers already downloaded I need to select it and open. I'm going to upload these two files. So you can see the both files are now available. Let's start exploring. So I'm going to click on first of all the neuroscience paper. So once I click you can see it's open on my left side. This one is a research paper on right side there is co-pilot options. So I would like to share three options which I like most in this app. I'm going to select some paragraph and you can see there are three options available. Summarize, explain text and related papers. So if I click summarize you can see here on the right side Science Copilot will summarize my paragraph into very small chunks so I can read it very easily. This is really awesome. Similarly, if I need explanation on something, I can select on explain text and this time you can see the Science Space Copilot will generate an explanation using a very common English words so you can easily understand and take uh, important notes from there. You can see here on the right side the explanation has been generated. Similarly, if you want more papers on the same topic, you can just click on the related papers. It will give you more options and more links so you can access the other papers also for the same topic. You can see on the right side the five papers links are recommended by Science Space Copilot so you can access and use these paper as well. This is really awesome. So let me go back to the library. So I came back to my library and let's explore more tools by choosing the second file which is absent.pdf. Now I'm going to uh, open this article. You can see here this is a research paper about uh, the effect of students absenteeism in the classroom in high schools usually. You can see here now I'm going to explore more tools. You can see on the right side automatically the science space copilot is given some options like contribution of this paper, related papers, results explain abstract conclusions summarize introduction and literature survey so you can just click on that and you can find out the literature survey for example or result not only these options there are some options available here as well you can see there are a lot of options for example if i want to check the result of this paper i need to just click on that and science space copilot in seconds it will generate some results for me. So you can see on the right screen the result of this paper is there. 
it is really amazing for teachers so you can make your research process very easier very quick you can find the papers related to you and you can immediately make a summary a conclusion or you can create literature survey i don't want to make this uh, video very long otherwise i'll show you all the uh, tools available here but you can explore it very easily and these all tools are very useful and very amazing uh, let's move to the last part which is the citation generator when we work on papers we know that the citation is one of the important and challenging part so science space uh, co-pilot will create a citation also for you so i'm just going to paste a link of a url which i want to cite i am going to cite it i just click on the site and you can say the main citation is going to be generated and if there is any in-text citation it will generate as well you can download it or copy the citation there are more options available for the citation styles you can use uh, different citation styles as well you can see here there is more than 2500 citation styles are available so friends you can utilize the science space co-pilot extension for your all educational research work so i recommend you to add this extension in your google chrome and try to utilize and enjoy the amazing options available in science space copilot so that's all for today i hope you enjoyed the video i hope this video is very useful for you so thank you very much if you have any question query or you need any support for making a decision don't hesitate to write an email to the teaching partner at gmail.com thank you very much and see you in the next video goodbye